Crown Princess Mary of Denmark, aged 51, has long been an advocate for sun safety and skin cancer prevention. Her deep respect for the harmful effects of ultraviolet, UV rays, heightened by a sunburn in her youth, has shaped her commitment to raising awareness about sun protection. As patron of the Sun Campaign, a joint initiative of the Cancer Society and TRYG Fondin, she encourages Danes to adopt sun-conscious habits. Mary, who diligently applies sunscreen with SPF 25 daily, is determined to set an example for her nation. A life marked by the sun. During a recent family vacation in Sydney, Mary and her children enjoyed a day at the beach. However, it was noticed that when the crown princess emerged from the water, she swiftly covered herself with a shirt and a hat. This sunsafe behavior speaks to her upbringing in Australia, a country acutely aware of the risks of sun exposure. It came as a shock to her to witness Danes sunbathing carelessly, as the population generally takes a different approach to sun protection. Mary's familiarity with Australia's sun safety practices prompted her to promote similar practices in Denmark. Although Denmark isn't renowned for its sunny weather, skin cancer is the most common cancer in the country, with over 9,000 new cases annually, and the incidence is rising. Melanoma, primarily caused by UV radiation from the sun and tanning beds, remains the most prevalent cancer among individuals aged 15 to 34, resulting in 2,500 new cases each year, leading to approximately 270 fatalities. A Personal Perspective Crown Princess Mary herself bears the effects of sun damage in the form of pigmentation changes, commonly referred to as sunspots, primarily on her arms. Sunspots, in themselves, aren't an immediate cause for concern, but it is crucial to monitor them closely to prevent them from developing into precancerous conditions. According to Charlotte Boving, a physician, author, and lecturer, when exposed to sunlight, damage and mutations can occur in the skin. Some of these develop into actinic keratosis, which is relatively benign, while others may progress to more severe conditions, with melanoma being the most feared. However, for common, benign sun damage, people don't generally feel as alarmed. They can appear unsightly and cause distress due to the potential precursors to cancer. Crown Princess Mary's choice not to conceal her sunspots, a common consequence of significant sun exposure, serves as an inspirational example for others to appreciate the importance of practicing caution in the sun. Her visible sunspots are a reminder that no one is immune to the potential effects of UV radiation, highlighting the necessity of sun safety awareness. Conclusion Crown Princess Mary's tireless advocacy for sun safety, stemming from her personal experience and her Australian background, is making a significant impact in Denmark. Her commitment to raising awareness about the dangers of sun exposure and her visible display of sunspots as a result of UV radiation serves as a valuable example for the public. As the face of the sun campaign, she continues to encourage Danes to prioritize sun protection, fostering a culture of care and prevention in a country where sun safety has become an increasingly important topic.